Hello and welcome to Adventures of a Travel Scoop Part 2. Okay, so, I'm, I'm still disabled. Get over yourself. Um, yeah, because that ain't going to change, but one thing I did do was I went on my honeymoon. Yay! I met a girl. She said yes. We said we'd get married. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We went to Creed, Glorious Creed. It was all five star. Yeah, man. So, I lost a stone. Um, I lost just over a stone before I went on my, um, before I went to get married in Greece. And I came back and I put on just over a stone. Maths are pretty good there, eh? Turns out I like the bread. But anyway, this is Crete. This is Adventures of a Travel Scoop Part 2. This is Crete. Let's throw to me, because I'm about to be on a travel scoop and just chilling from the airport. Ready? Go! Just landed in Crete. Travel Scoop was amazing and they took it off the great care actually of the Travel Scoop, which was fantastic. Um, it's brilliant, honestly. I didn't think that would ever happen. I thought it was broken up, but no. It just went in like it was and uh, it came out like it was as well, which was about fantastic. Um, so we're off to explore Crete. Bye. So welcome to Adventures of a Travel Scoop Part 2. I'm Wes, hello, and this is me on my honeymoon in Crete. Now, it's a five-star hotel. Honestly, I've not seen luxury like it before. This is a funicular railway. Oh, just get in. Get in. It's really hot. There's no air con in it. But you can look and you can see the island. I'll spin along all the way down there, okay? Hold on to the side, otherwise you might fall down. No one wants to fall down. That would be ridiculous. So, um, we're just waiting now to go down. You've got to wait for other people. I know it's not a private thing. You have to wait for other people. Like, oh my god, it's our honeymoon. Like, seriously? Are you kidding me? I'm just going to mess with the camera a little bit, I think. Yeah, got to make sure I get the the right the right focus there. Here we go. Oh, we go. Look around. Oh, we're moving. We are moving. As you'll notice, we are off. Uh, to the left, there are the private swimming pools that you get if you get a really good room. Like we did, actually. Yay! And as you come down, you think to yourself... I just want to be on that beach right now, and you have to wait a bit longer, a bit longer. Bear in mind, I'm sat on the travel scoot, and it's absolutely fine because there's no bumps like there were in Idra. No cobbles to run around and jump on and stuff. So, um, as you make our way down, it's pretty boring, to be honest. If I was you, I'd fast forward this part of the video, but we might stop in a minute. We might do an unexpected stop, and then people will look at me and be like, what? What is he doing in there? That man with his time machine from the future. <laughs> Hi there. Yeah, that's me. That's me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This could be a stop. Slowing down. Slowing down. No, no. Ha, ha. Oh, no, sorry. So we're carrying on. Okay, so we're in Crete. We're going down the Finicular Railway at the hotel. Um, It's just really slow. And it, oh, it's just going to get all the way down to the bottom. And, and there you go. <gasps> what? Someone pressed the button. Hello? Can you not see me in the... Uh, in the, in the, I was going to say tub, but that's not right. In the can? No, that's the toilet. That's not right either. But I'm just waiting. We're just waiting. And the best thing about it is you exit to the left. So I'm the first person to leave. Honestly, incredible. You can kind of see the reflection of my legs there. There's my leg. There it is in the swimming shorts. Hands on leg, ready to go. Come on, guys. Listen, we've got, we've got sun rays to not catch up on. Okay, we really don't. So there you go. So that's that. Uh, oh, yeah, we're off now. We are off and we are ready to roll. Here we go. The da the end is just down the bottom there. Um, and we'll hit it at 100 miles an hour. Boom. And then uh, we'll get out. Wow, this is slow, man. This is slow. Really slow. I mean, tortoise in the hair. Who gets to the pool quickest? Well, the one who goes the quickest. Oh, that's bright light, isn't it? That's bright light. Here we go. Here we go. Talking for the sake of talking, where's just enjoy the ride. Okay, we're coming now to the bottom, and uh, we'll be getting out. We're embarking on leaving right now. Oh, there we go. Someone waiting to get in. She's seen the travel scoot. She's moved away. Now, I turn around and say, hey, look, guys, can't you get out first? And they say, yeah, of course. Oh, hang on, hang on. We're nearly there. And we are there. That's all good, isn't it? Uh, yeah, we're there now. We are there. Finally, thank you. Um, so look to the left. We'll go to the left. Out. Which means I've got to now reverse out the travel scoot out. And I reckon I can do this probably in a one -er. In fact, everyone's left now. Just me in there, just waiting. I'm just waiting for everyone to go. And they're all, you can see them in the gap. Oh, there we go. I've reversed. I've turned around. And I'm going forwards. 
I, I made it, I made it. No, I've gone straight into the door. Oh no, it's okay. The missus just looking at me daft like I'm crazy. She's gonna come and help me. No, she's not. She's leaving me to it. Good third time lucky. Here we go. Fourth time lucky. Get out. Get out, you retard. What are you doing? Come on. Come on, you can do it. And I'm out. I'm off. I'm off. I'm off. So there you go. Five minutes to get down. Um, down the funicular, which is very nice. And this is the way. Um, you're on the travel scoot. And bear in mind, I would have had to walk this. All right, my lovely. How are you? You okay with your bag? Yeah, fine. Um, and they say in the write-up that it is disability friendly, okay? So mobility, not a problem is what they're saying. So you come down, which is very nice, over, yes, and you're still going, bear in mind, I'm on the scoot, just going down, could play a bit of ping pong, or a bit of, um, whatever that is, don't know, um, air, ho ice hockey, no, air hockey, air ice hockey, yeah, that kind of thing. Um, right, so we're coming down now, the scoot is still fabulous, oh, there's a couple of things in there, oh, we yeah, just hit one, on the floor there, that's not very mobility friendly, is it, but we'll let them off, it's fine. To the right of this... Um, this little gap thing is, is like probably gonna hurt if you go down it. Oh, just like that. Yeah, you didn't want that. Compared to Ouija, that was nothing at all. So, I just wait for my lovely wife just to go in front of me, and she will do. And then, oh, there you go. Look, look, straight in front of you. Partially, yeah, straight from you now. To partially to the right is spinner longer. That's where all the lepers were. Yeah, I know. Who would have thought, eh? They just all randomly turned together. I don't think it went that way, though. So we thought about going to spin longer, to be honest. Look at all the pools, man. They look amazing. We thought about going to spin longer, and then we kind of thought, well, how am I going to get over there on my scoop? We never gave it a chance, really. And it was like 40 euro to take a, a trip over there on the boat. Bear in mind, look how close it is. It's like 800 meters or 900 meters, I think it is. Um, we know because one of our friends used to swim it every day. And he'd get there, and they'd say, no, you cannot come on. And be like, oh, I just want to wait. Like, no. And be like, okay, fine. And then you go down. As you can see, it's still mobility friendly. Look at this go. Here we go. Travel scooter's ready to rock and roll. That looks like hot day because it is a hot day. Really hot. The hotel was fabulous. Um, if I remember, I'll put the um, details of the hotel into the, the box at the bottom of the video, okay? Uh, right, so there we go. Just following her. Come on, love, come on, get my way, get my way. I want to go fast. I want to go fast. Oh, 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 yeah, he's done it. He's lost the plot. I've literally lost my marbles. Oh, look at that beach. Granted, those are massive stones. That's not like a sandy beach, that's a stony beach, okay? It really is. Uh, the Haven, oh, darling, that's for the posh people. Oh, God. There was even a woman in, in, who was staying in the Haven, the three of them, three, three women... Um, probably cat lovers, to be honest. I think they're horrible. Um, and they were like, oh, we don't want to sit with the riffraff. She said the word riffraff. What a knobhead. I don't want to sit with the riffraff, whatever. So we've made it down, all the way down. Look at that, on the scoop, not a problem. There's a little gap there, but I'll make it over. And then boom. And then this is us leaving. The gate's open. Here I go. Thanks, love. Thank you. Here I go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, freedom at last. Freedom. <gasps> what shall I do with this freedom? I've just got out the um, out of the hotel. What do I do? What do I do? I mean, I'm just kind of, um, well, I'm using hand signals there and, and whatever. So let's go left. I think we should go left. Um, left sounds good to me. Yeah, there we go. Some lovely flowers there. And look at this pavement. I mean, that's a pavement right there. Look at that. So we are trying to get to Placa, which is... It's not even a town. It's just a street with many restaurants on. I'd probably say about 50 restaurants in total. And it was really nice to go down. And obviously, I didn't have to walk it. I could take the travel scoop, which was perfect. Absolutely perfect. And I didn't need the big wheels because that was no problem. Oh, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's a bus... There's a bus! There's a bus! It's gonna get me! Travel scoot! It's gonna get me! Ah! Oh, it's gone. It's gone. I mean, we saw it off, yeah? It saw the power of the travel scoop The 3.7 miles per hour and was like, nah, not a chance, mate. Not a chance. So, yeah, so we're just making our way down. As you can see, the travel scoot is, um... It's just living it, really. It's just... There's another bus. We're not scared of the buses now. We know, we know. Whoa! Well, there you go. 
And when they fly past you at 30 miles an hour, it does feel quite fast, to be honest. It really does. Um, so this is the road to the, I'm going to call it town, Placa, um, where we're going to get some lunch, okay? And look at the way the Greeks have put the signposts. It's about a foot in. Why would you do that? I don't. I literally don't know. And you'll see another one in a moment. It's ridiculous. But Travel Scoot is living the dream. We're happy with that. There's a little basket where I get to put all my stuff in and that. And we're going to buy some presents. So I'll probably put the presents in there. And then the, oh, that one was better, actually. That, that signpost, that was closer, closer to the wall rather than the other one, which was like a foot. Just living the dream. Hello, I'm a signpost. I'm in the middle of the road. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we're still going. Oh, there's some people here. Hello, mate. Oh, here we go. I think there's some people anyway. Let's have a look. Oh, it's a woman carrying some bags. Uh, should we wave and say hello? Or should she ignore us? Oh, she ignored us. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And I think we're coming to the end of the beautiful path. And you'll notice the path has got lights in it. So the path is lit up at night, supposedly. Um, which, which would be fun to do. <gasps> Uh-oh. Oh, no. There's three people. Four. Is it three or four? can't really see. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to screen round past them. Yep, there we go. Oh, the missus overtook us. That's fine. Um, and it's fine. Hello. How are you? You having a good holiday? Yeah, me too. There you go. Uh, so that's fine. All right, okay, so the path is coming to an end in a moment's time. Doesn't she look beautiful in that dress? She got so many great comments about the dress. It was amazing. She bought it from Accessorize. I know there's nothing to do with Travel School, but she bought it from Accessorize in the airport. In um in Athens. I'm sure it's Athens Airport she bought it from, so happy days. Uh oh. Uh oh, have you seen it? That is the end of the path. Now what am I gonna do here? Oh she's had a look round. She's like, What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you gonna go down? What are you gonna do? <sighs> I think I'm just gonna have a running jump, to be honest. There's a car. There is a car. And another car. There's three cars. Oh well, oh I'm just gonna go for it. Hold on tight. Oh, let me go! Just let me be free! Let me be free! I just wanna go! I wanna go! Yes! Yes! Travel scoot, not a problem, my friend. Not a problem at all. So we're just, um, making our way down. Oh, it says welcome! Well, thank you! It's another bus! There's a lot of buses around here. I mean, seriously? A lot of buses. This pavement is... I mean, it may look rubbish, but it's still better than anything... I got on Idra at all on the travel scoop. If you've not seen the Idra um, travel scoop video, that's part one. Please do check it out. You might like it. It's where it all began. Okay, so we're gonna cross over the road. I think in a moment. Got my babes. Cross over the road eventually. That's what we'll do. I think so. We're nearly there. Oh, it seems like a long time, doesn't it? Especially when you're talking and trying to fill for time. <laughs> so yeah. So I'm still on my travel scoop. Still living that dream. Still having a great time. Some more cars. Uh, might be able to just sneak down here in a second. Oh, we have to because I'm running out of fake pavement, it would seem. Oh, my goodness. Come on, come on. Come on, Wes, what are you doing? You're on the road now, mate, aren't you? You're on the road. Oh, he's on the road. You don't care, this lad. This lad doesn't care. He's straight over. He's not bothered. He's like, yeah, in your face. In your face, life. Oh, and I'm off. 3.7 miles per hour, kicking right in there, right in. Oh. And now we're slowing down. I think we're mating for the little lady. The new wife, if you will, to come and follow us. Here we go. The reason I do these videos is A, because I like talking. <laughs> and B, because I want you to see just how impressive the travel scoot actually is for people with a disability, people who can't walk far, uh, like me. I don't get paid by travel scoot. I, I, I don't even know I exist. So, um, so it's all all fair. It's all it's all fair and it's all there. <sighs> We're quite close now to getting to the main part of the town. Oh, someone, now this pavement is really small. Oh, thankfully they moved out of the way. Thank you guys. Thank you. See you soon. Oh, straight up. Now, this pavement's very small. The travel scoot's also quite small, but this pavement is a worry. Absolute worry. 
There you go. But it's nice. It's nice to drive on, though, so that's not a problem. Oh, there's a bit of a gap in the pavement here, so I have to sneaky, sneaky around it. Just go to the left, I think, and then back into the right. Yep, yeah, there you go. All good. Here's another signpost, just stuck, just in the middle of the of the path. It's not bothered. It's like, whatever. That'll do. There you go. Thank you. 30 miles per hour. Yep, yeah, very nice. Well, it's not even miles per hour, it's kilometers an hour, so it's at 20 miles per hour. It's not very fast, but that's okay though. It's alright, it's good. So, we're on making our way down now. Absolutely making our way down. Oh, this is, um, it feels slow, doesn't it? Does it feel slow to you? But the best thing about it is, I'm not walking. Just want to point that out, I'm not walking. So... There's a battery attached to this awesome scooter. Oh, come on, mate. I'll wait for you. No problem. Oh, no. He's gone. He's gone the road. Watch out. There's a bus. What are you doing, love? There's a bus there. Don't do that. Oh, yeah. High five. Thanks, mate. She's like, oh, I need to run over on that bus by that stupid travel scooter.